Welcome back to another video. Last week, I gave you some tips and tricks on time management. Well, this week, I wanted to get even more specific and share with you the actual programs that I use. Now, none of these companies are sponsors of this video. These are just the things I actually use to get the most out of my time. Time management is so important if you want to be a high performer. Now, everybody's going to be different, and so you're going to have to find the programs that you feel the most comfortable with. But my goal here is to just share with you what I do to give you some ideas of things you could try out. First, I want to start with an important concept. Keep your personal and your work information separate. This means separate calendars, separate computers, separate emails, and separate phones. Now, this might seem like an extra hassle, but there's a lot of reasons to keep your work life and your personal life as separate as possible. This keeps you from mixing your business and your personal information together, and it helps to create space between your business and your personal life. So just think about the situation. If you try and sell your business down the line, it's very difficult if all your personal information is combined with your business information. It's a mess, so keep everything separate. So here is a list of all the different things that I do to manage my time. Daily dream journal, calendar, to-do list, time card, and annual strategic plan. The goal here is to have a regular system you use every day to manage your time and to keep you on track towards your goals and dreams. If you use these tools on a regular basis, it will give you more control and freedom in your life. The goal is not to jam every minute of the day with work. The goal is to schedule your day so that you're living your dream life. If you are new to time management, this might seem excessive to you. This might seem like a lot. And when you're doing this at first, it's gonna take you a lot of time. But once you get used to making this part of your daily routine, keeping up with all of these things does not actually take very much time. I'm gonna go through each item briefly and explain the programs that I use. Daily Dream Journal. This is something I do every morning. I use a pen and a notebook. And I will daydream for 15 to 30 minutes in the morning, usually while I'm having a cup of coffee. You could do this on your computer, but I feel like writing makes it more creative and free flowing. I don't have to write every morning. Sometimes I'll just read the journal or I might watch a YouTube video on something I'm dreaming about lately. If you do this every morning, it energizes you for the rest of your day because it makes you realize that you are working towards your dreams. Calendar. For personal appointments, I use Google Calendar. For work appointments, I use an Outlook Calendar. And this is a helpful planning tool to schedule your time throughout the week. To-do list. It is very helpful to have a place to keep a running list of things to do. For personal items, I keep a list in Excel. And for work, I use tasks in Outlook. Something I find very helpful is I do a full review of my to-do list every Sunday night. I set aside 30 minutes to review what I accomplished the previous week, what I want to accomplish the next week, and any worries or items to celebrate. If there is something that has been stressing me out, I always write it down, and it reminds me to tackle it during the week and remove that stress from my life. Time card. Last week, I explained that I track my time on a time card from the minute I wake up to the time I go to bed. I use a free program called Clockify that you can access online and on your phone. You just click the time clock every time you start a new activity. And I find I switch to a new activity every one to two hours. And finally, annual strategic plan. This is what makes the magic happen. At the start of every year, I write down my strategic goals for the year. I use PowerPoint and put them into a slide presentation. Then everything you are spending your time on throughout the year should be moving you towards those goals. The appointments on your calendar, your to-do list, and your timesheet should all tell a story about you reaching your dreams. That is my system for time management. And I realize this is a lot for some people. With my personality, this is easy for me because I like to be super organized. I enjoy doing all of this stuff. For some people, it might be more difficult. But if you want to be a high performer in business, you need to find some method of managing your time that works for you. Now I want to hear from you. 
If you try any of these programs, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Let me know how it goes. I want to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Zach from Wolves and Finance. Let's go out and make some money.